Here are some examples of cinnabar. These are cinnabar crystals that are growing uh, on a white dolomite. And uh, these are it's very beautiful. Um, and here's another piece of the same. This, that's a cinnabar crystal and it's growing on a white dolomite. This piece has been cut to show the uh, veins, the veins of cinnabar that are running through this. So this is like a matrix piece here where this is like a vein filling um, type thing going on, which is a different process than these than these crystals here. Um, and this is this is what cinnabar ore looks like, where it's just kind of this blackish with a with with a little bit of red color, but it's not it's not as deep as the cinnabar crystals. And and uh, this is this is what they uh, crush up. This is cinnabar ore. That they crush this up and um, apply heat to it or chemicals, and that's how they create liquid mercury. Uh, this is an example of uh, of a finished and polished piece um, of cinnabar, and this comes from the Horse Heaven mine uh, in Oregon, which is uh, which is a ghost town now but which uh, was an operation from the 30s to the 1950s here in Oregon. Um, and this is, a, this is an example of what liquid mercury looks like. I'm not sure how good you can see that. And that's the, that's the chemical symbol for liquid mercury is capital H, lowercase g, and capital S. So that's what, that's what liquid mercury looks like. It's like a metal, but it's, it's at room temperature, it's a liquid. So if you like my uh, presentation today, if you like my video, please like, share, and subscribe. Uh, I really appreciate uh, you sharing with your friends. That'd be great. Help me get my YouTube channel off the ground. It'd be awesome. Uh, thanks again for checking out my video, and have a good day. LVX.